Here at the Permian Basin Petroleum Museum in Midland, it is rich in history. This is called the oil patch. Here's a little something that can help out, of course, an ice scraper. And that's it. You got to have skills like this. <laughs> I've failed a few times. There it is. Yeah. We have been talking about the St. Jude Dream Home. We're very honored to be part of this. We have a lot of volunteers here in our building. Happy Friday, everyone. We just wrapped up about half of our newscast here and gave our forecast. And we're going to have a lot of warm temperatures over the holiday weekend. Today on Central Texas Living, we'll meet with a few of the kitchen angels from Veterans One Stop as they prepare for their annual Thanksgiving feast. We take the time to appreciate the most important ladies in our lives. Not just Monica, but mothers all around. I'm know. a doggy mom. Are you? <laughs> Yeah. Well, there you go. Well, Honey and Chugs may be getting something for you. I hope so. And if you Please join me again, Delisa Russell, the director of Veterans One Stop. Wow. This event has been incredible. How many people have you fed so far? We want to remind folks why we're wearing this pink. Of course, there we go. Breast Cancer Awareness Month. For me, it's an issue that hits really close to home, and I know you know it affects so many people. We showed people the theater, but I'm going to take you through to the popcorn room. This is one of the most popular things about this melodrama. In fact, I'm told they fill up for each melodrama seven dumpsters a night. And this is what makes it so fun. People really get interactive with this. We're going to have Krista come in here with me. We have Cody. And we're going to be talking about the popcorn here. What do you guys do with this popcorn? You just throw it, right? They just throw it. It's $5 a bag, $20 a tray. You can see a lot of entertainment right here. Woo! Popcorn fried. Back to you guys.